an undisclosed location in North America. You are watching Card to Card. So this week's, or this episode, we don't do them every week anymore. Um, this episode is Stargate Project. And um, I thought this card was really cool. This is from the UFO set, first edition. Um, it is not a uh, beastie or anything, it's a spell. So you can see here the artwork there by Chris Campman. Um, interesting. You have like the men in black there. You have uh, a space penguin. And um, what's going on here? What is what is this card talking about? Because we know these uh, MetaZoo cards, they uh, are often based on real life things. So what is the Stargate Project? Well, in 1977... The U.S. Army established a secret unit. Um, this was located in Fort Meade, Maryland, and uh, they were uh, in the Army um, put together the DIA Defense Intelligence Agency and SRI International. They worked together to investigate the potential for psychic phenomena, uh, which was to be used in military and domestic intelligence applications. So. The, these projects had several code names. Um, one of them was Gon Gondola Wish, um, Center Lane, Sunstreak. Anyway, all these uh, similar projects in 1991, they were all consolidated into the Stargate project. So, what were they trying to accomplish here with the Stargate project? Well, the primary investigation was to see if like remote viewing, which if you haven't um, don't know what that term means, that means like a supposed ability to psychically see events, um, sites, or um, gather information from a great distance. So as you can see, the army would have they would have been keenly inter interested in this uh, if they're able to harness this power because they could spy on their enemies and um, you know. Um, they could spy on persons of interest without physically being there. Now, the Russians had claimed for many years that they had psychics that were able to do, you know, psychic things. And this was like the United States answer to, to, this, to their program. So, this unit was top secret. They're comprised of 15 to 20 individuals. And they are deep in a uh, top security location. Um, you know, deep down in the basement, I'm sure. So we actually have um, video from this deep, dark uh, security location of the Stargate project. Um, but we're going to, first we'll talk a little bit more about it, and then we'll, we'll run that video. Uh, we did want to say that, that the Stargate project was terminated and uh, declassified four years later in 1995. And the CIA came out and said that this is the CIA is the Central Intelligence Agency. They concluded that it was never useful in gathering usable intelligence. And um, there's actually this program, they don't mention the Stargate Project by name, but it inspired the uh, 2009 movie, The Man, The Men Who Stare at Goats. And I want to go check out that film. Because I, I remember that movie coming out, but I didn't know anything about it or what it was about. And now you kind of know what the story is. It's about the Stargate project. And so I'm kind of interested in seeing that. But, like I said, we have uh, actual video of this top security location um, of the Stargate project. Let's go ahead and run that now. Okay, that was not the Stargate Project. That that was a Stargate Project, I guess. That's from the movie Stargate. That has nothing to do with this. Why did you give me that video? <laughs> okay, so that's very confusing for this uh, episode. The Stargate Project had nothing to do with with making a Stargate that 
can take you from one one part of the universe to another part of the universe. This is a completely different Stargate project. Um, I guess we don't have video of that, unfortunately. But would have been very interesting. So anyway, this is the, the part of the video where we take a look at the art. Uh, this uh, Chris Campman art. I look at the flavor text of the card. And um, see if all this stuff that we've that we've uh, talked about in this video makes sense with the uh, card. So they, they have the men in black here. It wasn't really men in black that ran this project. It was the army and um, these uh, the DIA and the SRA, SRI um, doing this project. And they didn't use like aliens to do this. But there was probably in a room like this and um, trying to get these um, individuals to be able to remote view things. And apparently... Um, who knows what, what all kind of tests they ran on these individuals, but the CIA, and, you know, four years after they, um, well, actually it was, um, 18 years after they started this, these projects, the CIA, um, determined that, that they were not getting in useful information. So, um, who knows if they did find information, do you think they'd really tell us? I mean, come on. So, interesting device there on the, on the table there. Um, the uh, flavor text is always interesting to read. It says, Psychic energy is an underdeveloped form of magic. The men in black gave it their best try, but there appears to be a missing element. Perhaps a great seance can uncover the secrets to its power. So, there are MetaZoo here trying to hype up the uh, seance set, I think, with this card. But... Anyway, really cool. I'll always uh, remember this card now when I see it, if I open a pack of a of UFO and think back that this was a real project and um, actually an actual thing. Like some of these uh, um, cards are based on, you know, hearsay, like they, the, a story someone had, but this was a real project in the United States. And definitely go check out the men who stare at goats because that's uh, uh, based on the Stargate project. And this other Stargate project, that was a good movie too, Stargate. Go check it out if you haven't seen that movie. It has nothing to do with this Stargate project, but it is a cool movie and it's definitely an army-centered um, thing. I wonder if they got the name of the Stargate project from Stargate. It said 1991. I don't know when Stargate actually came out. But... Uh, there are some similarities there with being deep down in a top secret area that the uh, government was trying to uh, use. It just wasn't using the same thing. All right. Um, so next time you're, I guess, in, uh, in um, where was this? In Maryland, Fort Meade, and uh, someone grabs you uh, and um, says, hey, what are you doing here? Keep your eyes out. I mean, guess guess keep your eyes out before you get grabbed. But, you know, I'm out.